A human rights group has faltered the activities of the International Criminal Court and Amnesty International in Nigeria. The Group Congress for Human Rights in Nigeria noted that the report of ICC and Amnesty International over the issues of insurgency in some part of the country are not well investigated. The group leader, Lawal Johnson, described the activities of the two organizations as biased and something that can cause disunity in the country. They stressed that such acts can frustrate the efforts of the military and slow down the ongoing war against the terrorists in Nigeria. The group, however, appealed to international communities and other concerned citizens to call these organizations to order. Today, as we speak, many of our fighting men and women have been dispatched to great beyond through the needless and meaningless assaults of these bloodsuckers. While many of our military men and women have lost their limbs, why some are receiving treatment at various military hospitals in the country? Many of our women have overnight become widows. Why the dream of promising young men and women have become sh has, has been cut short by these bloodsuckers? But the almighty ICC and Amnesty International do not seem to see all this. How come it is only in Nigeria that the Amnesty International and ICC always try to undermine? We don't want both ICC and Amnesty International on our shores anymore. As they have shown their interest lie with the enemies of Nigeria.